guys welcome back to my channel so today we're going to make some easy 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 Philly cheese steak so as you can see it don't require a lot of ingredients because it's real simple it's real easy and just a little close-up picture for you this is the steak I be using I have my cheese I have the rolls I have the seasoning with the salt and pepper in the back I have onions and I have peppers. And these are some onions that I've been using for the last couple of days. And if you are onion lover like me, I suggest you get the big onion because it lasts a long time. So let's get into it. All right, so I already cut my peppers up and my onions and this is how I cut them up. So it's up to you the way you want your onions and your peppers to look, but this is just how I decided to cut mine up. I already got my pan going, so we're going to saute the vegetables, and we're going to try to use the same pan. So after you saute the vegetables, you want to wash it out so you can get ready for the meat. All right, so right here, the only thing I'm doing is seasoning the steak on both sides. I'm seasoning the steak with the seasonings that you saw at the beginning of the video. So just make sure you season the steak on both sides. All right, so we're going to go ahead and move on to the bread. I already opened one off camera, so I'm going to show you guys how to do it on camera. So basically what you want to do, we, we're gonna, you want to get a pan, and we're just going to boil the bread, not for long because it don't take um, a long time for the bread to be toasted. And this bread right here already have an opening, as you can see right here. So I don't have to do much. But if you get bread that doesn't, that just make sure you cut it through so where you can put the meat and the vegetables in, but not all the way. So just be mindful of that. And we're just going to repeat this step. And then I'm going to wait until the meat is done, then put the um, bread in the oven because it won't take long. So I'm just going to repeat this while we wait for the, um, while, before I move on to the, um, to the meat. All right, so now what you want to do, I got my bread out. Just take a knife, some mayonnaise, however much you prefer. You just want to spread that. It's toasted, so that's why. And you can toast your bread for however long you want to toast it for. I don't know what you like. It will be up to you. All right. Set that to the side, and then you want to take your meat out the pan. Pretty much like that. You need to take your fork with your vegetables, and you can put however much you want to put on there. It's up to you. So this is how the Philly cheese steak is looking. 
this is going to be bomb. Looks so good. So good. Get into these onions, this cheese, these peppers. Get into it. <laughs> 